The vlogs are finally back! I know that that may sound a little bit too ambitious considering the fact that I've done only three vlogs for the three years that I've been on YouTube. I wanna be consistent with those and I'm gonna do my best to upload a new one every week. So this week starts off with me wanting to change my backdrop for my makeup videos. <laughs> okay, so this here is my backdrop. I wanna change it because I've been filming with it for quite some time and sometimes I get questions what I use for my backdrops it's fabrics. I get them from eBay, super affordable. But now I'm gonna put this one on, um, this really nice blue one. This feels like nylon. It was really difficult to iron it. Um, I iron all of my backdrops, it just it looks better. So let's go ahead and see how this one will look, okay? And focus, okay? This is the backdrop. I love it. What do you guys think? Whew, it looks so good. Maybe a little bit vibrant, but I like it. <laughs> Um, yeah, you probably already saw a few videos with this look, with this look, <laughs> with this uh, backdrop, so yeah, hope you like it, hope you enjoy it, I love it. Blue is one of my favorite colors though, I, hold on, let me just switch the cameras. This is it, this is how I look, this is my boyfriend's shirt, a really odd one that he had, um, but yeah, this is the backdrop, I put like 5,000, <laughs> 5,000 clips. Um, in order to really stretch it and make it look as even and smooth as possible. This is what I use to clean my desk and everything. So. I wish I could also clear my mind with that thing and finally decide what I want. That backdrop didn't last for too long. I changed my mind pretty quickly. <laughs> You see what I'm talking about later through the week. There is one meal that I can eat every single day and it seems like I can never get tired of it. I've been eating that every single day for the past two months. So here, I'm gonna show you my great cooking skills. Enjoy! I could make it look so much more beautiful, but honestly, right now I'm so hungry. I can't like I I can't take the time to make it look beautiful. So okay, I'm gonna go eat this. <laughs> I made some spinach pie for Dimitri. I mean, I didn't make this. <laughs> Obviously, I don't have the skills to cook this. We bought this frozen, and I just baked it. It's so so delicious. It has some spinach inside. And um, this is what Dimitri is gonna have and I'm gonna have some peaches and yogurt. If you had to choose between the spinach pie and the yogurt and peaches, which one would you pick? Yogurt and peaches, you know it's better, you know it! <laughs> I'm going to get my nails done. I really like this design that I did. I saw it on the internet. I don't know who was the original creator but I got inspired by a photo on the internet and I really love it but it's time for something new now. So we just, that was an email, so sorry about that. So we just came back home, we picked some groceries. We didn't want to take too much out because we're going to Bulgaria in a week and I didn't want to have food in the fridge for like 10 days, so it would go bad. So yeah, we just picked some stuff for this week. So I'm gonna show you my nails, but just let me take care of these guys because I need to put them in the fridge, it's so hot. love this thing so much. I can eat this every day and never get bored. This is Greek yogurt, by the way. So good. And more. I doubt we can eat all of this in a week, but <laughs> we'll try. <laughs> That's a lot of fruit, you guys. What was I thinking? As you probably already know, I love peaches, but this time in the grocery store, they didn't have the usual peaches. They had these, which are a little bit more pale and they're just lighter in color and 
I'm a little bit skeptical about those. I really hope they taste as good as the usual peaches, but... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> the camera has been recording the ceiling for three minutes. What? <laughs> I haven't done a vlog for so long, you guys. I I forgot how to do it. It's not that I ever knew. This is how I did my nails. What do you guys think? I think that they, they turned out so, so pretty. So this color is called lemon. This is mango. And I also have some flowers on this finger. I got my inspiration from Instagram. This is actually the photo that I saw. Look at them. Oh, my phone is so dirty. <laughs> so pretty. These nails are absolutely stunning. Oh, let me hit like. There we go. They look super similar, right? Obviously, these are a lot longer than mine, but still really cute i wish i could function with so long nails i feel like when my nails are too long i just can't do anything with my hands it's so uncomfortable for me i i really can't stand having long nails i prefer my nails as short as possible because it's so much easier to do stuff <laughs> i can't imagine cooking with that long nails <laughs> you have so much leftovers of food under your nails once you're done cooking <laughs> i just i don't know short nice clean and comfortable that's how i like my nails what do you guys prefer do you prefer long nails short nails medium nails there are many ways you can find out if somebody truly loves you the truth is in the actions not in the words i came to a really important conclusion regarding my relationship with dimitri here check it out this guy he loves me a lot <laughs> you know how i know that because he's going to get my package from the post office while I wait him in the car with air conditioner on. Outside, super hot. That's how I know he loves me. <laughs> so, guys, whoa, that's so zoom. I did a major change in the background of my makeup videos. It's something really new for me. I've always wanted to have a background like that for my videos, but I've never actually had the space to do it. I'm gonna show it to you once we're back home. Now I'm waiting Dimitri to come back from the courier. I'm hoping that it will be something that I got for this camera, like a small tripod. I'm really hoping that it will be it. Hoping he's coming back, he's coming back. <laughs> The camera is like, no, I don't want to focus on him. All right, so this is it. Let's see what's inside. How am I going to open this? I don't know how I'm going to open it. <laughs> this will do. A little unboxing for you guys. Yay! Nice. Now, how am I going to open this thing? Oh, hold on, I think I know. Success. So this is what I got. I just wanted to have something to hold the camera. It's so much easier, you know, to hold it this way. Okay, do you guys see any difference? <laughs> Probably not. This is how it looks. It's so much easier to hold the camera this way. All right, so now we're gonna go do some shopping. We wanna get some stuff for the house and for my new setup. I can't wait to show it to you guys. Let's see what we've got. This here <laughs> is a lamp. It's a really nice one, by the way. It looks like I got some really random stuff, but I promise you, uh, they're not random. Let's see what else we got. I don't know if I have batteries for this. I also got these little lights. You can press here and you're gonna see how they shine. Ooh, so beautiful. It reminds me of Christmas. <laughs> and lastly, I also picked this um, love sign. It's a light, so I need to put batteries and it will light up. So let me show you why I got all of this stuff, okay? So this is where my backdrop used to be. This is where I put that really bright blue fabric at the beginning of the vlog. But now I want to use this part of the studio as my backdrop. I have some... It's... It's a total mess here today. So that's why I got the stuff. I want to place them in there. I want to use them as a decor at the back. I'm going to just play now. See how I'm going to place the stuff. All right. So this is the end result. This is what we have. This is going to be my backdrop for my next few videos. 
What do you guys think? <laughs> I added some flowers, the heart light, the love sign, the cactus house, I don't know, and also the little lights. So this is how it looks. I thought that I could fit more in the frame. I thought that I could also fit this part of the wall, but I can't. <laughs> You're only able to see this through the camera when I'm, I'm filming my makeup videos. So yeah, oh, I need to take care of this stuff. It's so messy. <laughs> the thing with me is that I always want to change stuff. I always want to try to make things better and try out new stuff and switch up things. And I'm getting bored really easily. So I'm always always trying to upgrade stuff around the house and you know in my videos and basically in my life now with the vlogs you'll be able to see more behind the scenes stuff like the background struggles for my makeup videos so the next day I decided to film my first video with my new setup I just finished filming the tutorial on this look you guys I don't know for some reason I feel so tired today i couldn't sleep last night i was having some crazy nightmares for some reason i was i was dreaming of some really scary stuff i couldn't sleep i was waking up all the time and in the morning i woke up and i was just uh i'm kind of sad right now sad and tired not a good combo <laughs> i'm feeling a little bit sad because i really like how this makeup came out but i have nowhere to go and i honestly don't have the energy to go anywhere <laughs> we're gonna probably order something to eat i have no energy to cook to go out no energy to take it off <laughs> no I'm, I'm over exaggerating a little bit but uh yeah i just i'm gonna go take it off now what can you do <laughs> can carry all that you've got to every hearts is not a lie i will put out a love of fire we stumble and fall in the start of love that i die i can hide Look at all those leftovers of makeup that I had in my hairline. Look at that. That's so much makeup. <laughs> Always take care of your hairline. And also your neck. Okay, so I don't have a crazy skincare routine right now. I mean, no, I actually have a crazy skincare routine right now. But I'm going to a new dermatologist. I feel like the previous one that I had wasn't treating me properly. So I went to a new one. I'm trying to treat all of those acne scars and, you know, spots that I have on my, on my face. So I'm on a crazy skincare routine. It's really strict and... Yeah, I'm basically treating those stuff. I'm moisturizing mainly in the morning. At night, I'm treating those things. Now, I'm gonna apply some spot treatment and I'm gonna remove it later on at night, apply something else, you know. This care routine is really unusual for me. Normally, I would just apply my moisturizing creams and stuff, but now I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna use some eye cream and then some spot treatment. So, I'm done. So, update on the peaches. They were awesome. <laughs> Later on, I found out that there are two types of peaches, yellow and um, white ones. I've never tried the white ones. It was my first time trying them out, but I ate them all. I thought that because they weren't that saturated, they wouldn't be that delicious, but they were great. See? No peaches. I ate them all. And this is the situation with the fruits. We're living in four days. I'm really hoping that we can eat all of those in four days. <laughs> Alrighty guys, that's all for this week. This pillow has been sitting really awkwardly here. I don't know where to put it. I'm gonna see you guys in my next video, which is going to be my makeup tutorial with my brand new setup. So wait for it. Expect it. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Also, you can find me on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, all of the links, you know, down in the description box. See ya!